welcome to a new video welcome back if you have been here before and if not welcome my name is Dee I live and run a well-being studio here in Canberra Australia and I just love kind of sharing bits and pieces of my life during the week as well as behind the scenes of my business and just sharing information on aromatherapy and just ways to live a calmer more content and peaceful life so if that is something that you are interested in I would love for you to subscribe please hit the little subscribe button and join me here it is Thursday already so this video is just going to be a few days in my life I don't have that much probably to share with you this week uh, yeah I'm off to my part-time job this afternoon so this is week two and it's going well hasn't been that busy yet I think it's just taking time for the wellness center that's where I'm working at the new float and wellness center in the city if you didn't know if you didn't see the last couple of videos where I've talked about it uh, but yeah I guess it's just taking them a little bit of time to build up but yeah I've done a few treatments there and it's been lovely beautiful place to work and I am off there this afternoon as well and then back in my own well-being studio for Friday Saturday Sunday and Monday it's a long weekend here so I'm not that busy yet but um, we'll see what happens I'm fairly busy tomorrow I've got a quiet day on Saturday so we might go for a walk in the afternoon if I don't get any appointments because we did not go yesterday uh, yeah we didn't do our usual hike yesterday so uh, yeah and then Sunday I've still got some appointments available and same for Monday which is actually the public holiday so yeah not a lot probably are coming up over the next few days but what I have decided with these weekly videos is that I'm going to film from Monday to Sunday rather than kind of starting them midweek which is what I used to do what I've actually done this week but I just thought if I finish off on Sunday then that just gives me a little bit more time to just edit and get them up on Wednesday get the yeah get the, the weekly video up on Wednesday I did post a lovely little mini meditation this week so yeah if you need to just relax and release especially before the weekend or during the week if you're having a stressful week it's just a nice little mini meditation that you can do so yeah go check that out if you would like to but before I go for today I wanted to share something with you a little find that I am loving and it is this Sephora lip stain so that is that going to come into focus yeah so I wanted to just find a little lipstick that would stay on all day for my new job <laughs> so yeah I've just found this and I love it I love this color this is color number six and it is just called the what's it called just cream lip stain and I thought I'd just mention it because it is on special at the moment I think it's normally $24 or something like that 25 maybe and I'm just having a look it is on sale now for I think it was $16 something why can't I see the price $16.80 normally $24 yeah so and it comes in heaps of different colors too so yeah just thought I would share that with you other than that I don't think I have anything else to say at the moment but I will pop in I thought I might do a nice winter oracle card reading for us so I might pop in either later today or sometime over the weekend and yeah do that I thought that might be nice with the new season here yeah, that is it for now. I shall chat more soon. Good morning. Happy Sunday. It is, yeah, Sunday morning. I don't have any appointments this morning, so fully booked this afternoon, but I thought I would just pop in and do a beautiful Moon Deck Oracle card reading to finish off this week's video. I thought I might make this maybe a little weekly segment because I feel like 
these vlogs are going to be a little bit more chatty from now on because with my new job, my new part-time job, and working at the Wellbeing Studio, I've got to kind of fit things in and around and I probably won't be doing that much. Like we will do our weekly hikes most weeks, so I can share that with you and any other walks that we did. We did a beautiful walk yesterday afternoon, as you would have seen in the previous clips because I was a bit quiet yesterday afternoon, so that was nice. But yeah, these vlogs might end up being a little bit more chatty and I thought a little weekly oracle card reading might be nice. So we're going to use the moon deck this week and we'll just give them a beautiful shuffle. I thought also too with the change of season and everything it might be nice to do a little oracle card reading but yeah then I was just thinking this morning it might be nice to have a little weekly oracle segment and I can use all my different decks and uh, yeah, share them all with you and use them oracle decks and tarot decks so let's just do I'm just sitting on the floor here so I'm just going to spread those out for you to see <laughs> and we might just pick this one here I think I free myself from critical thoughts towards my body and my worth oh how lovely is that are we in focus I think we are isn't that just a beautiful card? You guys know I love these cards. If you've been watching for a while, you know I love these cards. If you have this deck, that is number 44. It's the last card of the deck, I believe. I think this is 44 cards. If my memory serves me correctly. Yes, it does. So this is the worth card. So as I said, I free myself from critical thoughts towards my body and my worth. Such a beautiful reminder. We are perfect and flawed all at once. To deny this is to deny the experience of being fully alive. Although we all share this truth, we tend to be hardest on ourselves and may have developed a fierce inner critic. This voice has power. Don't banish it. Instead, teach this voice to be more uplifting and supportive. Notice when negative thoughts sneak in and choose to think differently. As you free yourself from unhealthy thought patterns, tune into what your real needs are. Recognize your desire to be loved and know that you're worthy beyond measure. Like any devoted practice, the retraining of your mental habits craves consistency. Continue showing up for yourself with kindness and compassion. Your inner critic is ready to transform into a more loving and productive voice in your life. <sighs> I don't know about you, but that I think is just beautiful continue showing up for yourself with kindness and compassion that just if you take nothing else from this little reading please always remember that and yeah just remember too that consistency is key in pretty much every single thing we do every thing that we desire for ourselves consistency is what will create those things in your life what will bring things to fruition like doing something once is uh, probably not going to get you the exact results that you want <laughs> but certainly consistency is super super important and yeah just don't be hard on yourself just be kind and compassionate to yourself just like you would with your best friend or your mum or your sister or your partner anyone in your life uh, yeah, you are always kind and compassionate towards them. So please do the same for yourself. What a lovely, lovely card. Oh. Happy Sunday. Enjoy. You'll be watching this. I'll be uploading this on a Wednesday. But yeah, I hope you are having a, a fabulous week. And I will chat to you in another video soon.